Mm, no. And um, this is first time playing for Witcher. Wild Hunt. I have uh, played in heard rumors about this game for the past three years, and I thought, you know, with the Witcher, Witcher the Netflix series, and coming out, I thought it might be a good idea to um, start up some gameplay regarding the Witcher. New game. That's me a guild of Rivia.
amusing. It wasn't meant to amuse, but to prod you to hurry. It's midday already. You promised Siri you'd train with her. Go before Vesemir bores her to death with those etchings. So, later then. Hmm. See you later. Okay, we're in Kaer Morhen, home of the witches. Oops. Sorry if my controller is a wee bit dodgy. Shit, mountain pass is beautiful as ever. No, living somewhere, you know, like this in the Witcher world, it would definitely take your breath, breath in really easily. You know, the author of a Witcher and and Andreas. They've done a beautiful job. Is fast asleep. Ceres disappeared somewhere, of course. Guess she prefers practice to theory. Mm. <laughs> Why? Time to wake up, Master. 
These lessons so boring they put you to sleep too? Damn it. After taking notes on ghouls and owl ghouls, wanted to rest my eyes a bit. <laughs> Making her slog through that brick? No wonder she took off. John of Bruges lacks flair, true, but he's reliable. Not like the hogwash they print nowadays. She's tackling the pendulums, right? How many times do I have to tell her? Don't train alone. It only embeds your errors. Bring our young damsel to the lower courtyard. If she wants to practice, she'll get to practice. <laughs> Don't get mad at her. Why the hell not? The whippersnapper refuses to do as she's told. You like that about her? Fine. I suppose I'm partly to blame, but this has yep, to I'm end. enjoying now. it. <laughs> Killing monsters is not something to be taken lightly. Siri must understand that if she's to become one of us. I'll see you below. So eager to practice. Strike. Could you just imagine how difficult the training course would be based on balance, position? You're not in this circus, pirouette. Wrong. Footwork. Enough. Get down. With a flip? What do you think? <laughs> All right. Take off the blindfold. You've got work to do. Your reflexes are still slow. Maybe for a witcher. Think drowners or striggers will go easy on you because you haven't undergone the mutations? Though in your shoes, I'd fear Vesemir more than any Striga. Disobeying his instructions? Unwise. Well, yes, but that book was horribly dull. I know. And you know that's no excuse. <sighs> I'm sorry. It won't happen again. Better not. Vesemir said if it does, he'll make you eat a bowl of slugs covered in salt. <laughs> you! Exactly. So you best behave. Come on, we'll practice with the others down below. Shall we run the walls? <laughs> of course. Is a witcher school or an elven bathhouse? Beat you to the bottom. <laughs> Maybe if you fall. Hmm? Ah, fuck. Breathing through your mouth in rhythm with your steps. Siri, cut it out. Hmm? I just do this. God's sake, say. I win. Your legs are longer. I'll show you yet. Just need to grow a Got time to forget I had notifications. <laughs> Anything to say for yourself, young lady? 
I'm very sorry, Uncle Vesemir. Young blood craves action, I understand that. But when you fight a beast, knowledge counts as much as your silver sword. At the very least, you ought to be able to tell a ghoul from an owl ghoul. By markings, like unto the Panthera Tigris that in Zeracania dwells, and by the sickly paleness of its visage. Mm. So you did read the chapter. <laughs> Still, you should have asked. Yeah, it's cool. Mm. Hope you have a um, good, you know, a wonderful you know, Christmas, um, Richardo. Don't try to weasel your way out of this. A witcher must know how to trick his opponent. You said so yourself. Might have, but don't use my words of wisdom on Vesemir. Got it? That's playing with fire. Fine, we've talked enough. Geralt, you're with me, Lambert with Eskel, Siri with the dummy. Again? Stop <laughs> okay. and grab a sword. What do you think? Should we start by reviewing the fundamentals or go right to free training? Should work on the basics. Even skilled masters need to hone the fundamentals, and Ciri's barely a novice. Draw your sword, Geralt! the day to a close, we'll go over a few witches signs. Let's start with... Oh. Siri, Gwen is sometimes called the witch's shield. Now watch carefully to see why. Fast Igni, Geralt. I want to see sparks fly. Not for the Quen sign. I'd be aflame by now. Hard, Geralt. Come on. See that, Siri? Art will knock anyone or anything off balance. Destroy their rhythm. Time for axing. Damn it. I hate this feeling. Axie can really muddle your mind. Murder now. Show her, Geralt. See this, Siri? 
couldn't move my whoop so above. Don't worry, Siri. Quandle dampen the blow. Continue training come on, well. come closer. Heads up. She's back. We'll send her to polishing all the swords at Kaer Morhen. Find that helmet? Siri? Uh, I'll make sure to find every last blade for you. Some way off, we've got time. Started in the guest room at Kaer Morin. I was relaxing in a tub, and next to me... Tris? Yennefer. Funny, isn't it? She's never been there. Seemed so real in my dream, though. Was she nagging you about something? <laughs> True to life, indeed. We'll find her. found Siri. Then we trained. Those were the days. Mm. Little she-devil. <laughs> I've trained kids who were faster, stronger, but none had her character. Didn't end well, did it, your dream? No. The wild hunt appeared, attacked Siri. I couldn't move, stood there like a stump. It was just a dream. That's the problem. It was more. 
In the past, when Siri appeared in my dreams, something was wrong. She was in danger. We taught her how to defend herself from anything, wraiths included. Be downing soon. Time to go. Wait. Show me the letter from Yennefer. Might have overlooked some hint in there. Didn't overlook anything. We were meant to meet in Willoughby. That's what she wrote. Meanwhile, one army or another burned the village to the ground. All we can do is follow her trail, so... Stop talking for a minute and give me the letter. Ah, how about that? It does smell of lilac and gooseberries. You were gonna read it, not sniff it. We must meet soon. Will it be near Vizima? Hmm. Nothing else to guide us there. What's this postscript? I still have the unicorn? Stuffed unicorn. Used it once or twice. In certain situations. Hmm. The things young folk get up to these days. Back on topic. How's it look? How far behind Yennefer are we? Two or three days. Trail's fresh. But it looks like it leads towards the main road. Could be muddled there. Wait, hear that? I hear it. I smell it. Ghouls. What now? I knew. Couldn't stop talking about how useful they are as creatures. Because you can brew potions from their blood? <laughs> no. Because by eating rotting corpses, they prevent epidemics. Hmm. Did he know they eat the living as well? No. Really upset him, too. His theory collapsed. Not exactly going our way. We have a side. The Northern Realms. Radovid's realms, don't you mean? Tamaria and Edirne are no more. Radovid's pledged to restore the old borders as soon as he wins the war. Believe that? <laughs> Gotta believe something. That's what keeps us going.
Have to go. Yeah. Come out. Hello. <laughs> God, that was close. I was sure I'd end up like my mare. Provided you got lucky. Your horse died quickly, but Griffins like to toy with their prey. Eat it alive, piece by piece. Oh. You'd... you'd like a reward, I suppose. You don't owe us anything. You were in need. We helped. And they call witches heartless. Say they won't lift a finger without pay. They also say mice are born of rotting straw. Back to the trail. Like I said, leads to the main road and ends there. Muddled. You seek someone. Yes, a woman. Medium height, long black hair. Seen anyone like that? No. But there's an inn here in White Orchard. Sole one around gets its share of travelers. Perhaps you'll learn something there. Besides, the inn keeps my cousin. Tell her Bram sent you. She'll treat you like family. Not a bad idea. Especially since that wound needs cleaning. Ah, beast barely grazed me. But sure. Use a good rye, nice and cool, you know, straight from a cellar. Let's go. Oop. Sure, but here? Near the main road. Maybe it's the war. Corpses everywhere, the stench of blood, burnt flesh. Drives monsters crazy sometimes. Men, too. We need to watch ourselves in White Orchard. And we should leave as soon as we learn it. Tamerian lilies. They've a right to hang there. This ain't Tamaria no more, old man. It's Delfgard now. My arse it is. Freaks. Beg your pardon for those thugs. No need. We're used to it. Folk are jumpy around here. Armies just pass through. 
Now a griffin's prowling about. Mm -hmm. Already had the pleasure. Ran into your kinsman, Bram. Bram? How is he? Alive. Sends his regards. Master witches. Food and drink on the house. What can I get you? There a contract on that griffin? Nay, not at the moment. Used to be. As soon as a beast had built a nest nearby, the alderman would start a collection, or go to the lord for help. Now the alderman don't use the privy without asking the black one's permission first. And, seems they hanged the lord. So no contract. Shame. We might have done something, but not for free. Looking for a woman. Raven-haired, violet eyes. Dresses in black and white, riding in from Willoughby. And, uh, strange as it sounds, lilac and gooseberries might have smelled that. I've not seen nor smelt such a lady. I believe I'd remember. Yeah, especially hard to forget this one. Plenty of travelers about, though. Folk from all over. Might be worth your while to ask after her. Thanks. For everything. that up? Please. I'm not decrepit yet. Then I'll ask about Yennefer. Mm-hmm. Just remember, we'd rather not draw any attention. Here. Black One's been out measuring the fields. Let him measure. Better that than burning the harvest. Drommel. Drommel, you're dumber than a headless cockerel. Why are they marking out them lines, eh? Pass them out their patrimony. I'm looking for someone. And we seek some peace and quiet. Out of my face, freak. For your breath sours my beer. Just want to talk. You deaf, Stray. No one here will talk to you. If it's company you seek, stick that mangy snout of yours in a trough with the pigs. <laughs> Show that shit eater, Micah. Patience. Once it's gone, your heads will roll. Oh, we was jesting. No call for anger. See a raven-haired woman here, dressed in black and white? We know nothing, sir. Leave us be. Once more, there are four factions. Four what? What a waste of time! The Earth shall revolve around the Sun before you comprehend these rules. Got a minute? Why not? Aldert Git, Assistant Professor in Contemporary History at Oxenfurt Academy. Geralt of Rivia. Witcher, with tenure. I'm looking for a woman. Long hair, dressed in black and white. Seen anyone like that? <laughs> of course not! Unlike the populace, I know the horsewoman of war is pure poppycock. Horsewoman of war. What's that about? Folks say an omen. A beautiful phantom rides the fields at night, looks as you described her. Armies follow her, and all who cross her path meet with misfortune. I can vouch for the last bit. Know where they saw her? No facts interest me, not fairy tales. War reached Novigrad yet? Nope. But it's only a matter of time. Nilfgaard on one bank, Redania on the other, drooling over the city like dogs over a juicy bone. Many a ruler's choked on that bone. True. We value our liberty in Novigrad, and we know how to fight for it. Mm -hmm. The scholars especially. The sword is not the only weapon. Do not forget, architects from our academy designed the city walls. Walls no war machine has ever crumbled. So long. A moment, Witcher. You strike me as a man of the world. Are you familiar with Gwent? No, and I don't have time to learn. But the rules are quite simple. Come, let's play. 
No thanks. Got some other things on my mind. Shame. I'd ask the locals, but since they can't count to ten, the rules are a complete mystery. Ah, well, I'm here if you change your mind. Looking for a woman. Uh, like everyone. Not like everyone. And not just any woman. Mine smells of lilac and gooseberries, dresses in black and white. Two schnapses. <laughs> It'll lift your spirits. Fine, I'll have a drink. Can we cut to the chase? You seen her or not? Jennifer of Wengelberg. Never mentioned her name. Yet you described her perfectly. Once I hear something, I never forget. Come help him. How do you know Yennefer? What a question. Master Dandelion's ballads, of course. The only way a humble merchant might hope to rub up against greatness. Unless, that is, he's as lucky as I am. And runs into a very patient witcher. It's a Geralt of Rivia himself, the Butcher of Blaviken. You seen Yennefer? Deepest apologies, but I must ask, is this about love? Guessed it. It's love. I knew it at once. What do you know? Tell me. Before you appeared, it never occurred to me that might have been Yennefer. Who would have thought? Get to the point. An elf guardian scout from the local garrison saw her. Where? At their camp. She rode in there. Dark of night. Black and white. Gooseberries and... Yes. I oh, know. Had a terse exchange with the garrison commander and raced off. Where to? <laughs> I'm not omniscient. Ask at the garrison. Thanks. We men of the road must stick together. Perhaps one day I'll be in trouble, and you'll be nearby to help. Done drinking? Mm -hmm. Then fuck off! <laughs> Don't want your kind here. Wouldn't want to stay long anyway. Maybe not. And maybe you'll just stay forever. Six feet under.
Let's go. I can now put that out of myself. of power should draw from it.
humming. Place of power, it's gotta be. Go, go. Come on. 
That's it, Roach. Military camp. No locals allowed without the express consent of the garrison commander. I look like a local to you? You look like trouble. Dead wrong. I make trouble go away. I'm a witcher. A witcher? Captain Peter Sugwin Levy is in the tower. Turn right, past the gate. Guessing your captain's got work for me. This is the army, Nordling. There is no guessing. To the tower. Go. I have no gun garrison. And this is where I'm going to end my video here. Hope you, hope you enjoyed this um, broadcast. And wish you all a happy Christmas. And a new year. Hmm. See you later. I'm going to land one.